Welcome to Infigyan friends. In this video, we will be solving one very interesting question on system of equations. Given equations are x root x over y plus y root y over x equal to 244 over 9, root x plus root y equal to 4. x, y belongs to real numbers. So let's get started by considering equation number 1, equation number 2. Now I will use substitution. The square root x is equal to a. The square root y equal to b. So a must be positive. b must be positive. From first one I can write x value it will be a square. y value from second one it would be b square. Let's rewrite our equation one. x root x. So a square times a divided by y. y is b square plus y root y, so b square times b, divided by x, it is a square, equal to 244, divided by 9. Or I can write a cube over b square, plus b cube over a square, equal to 244, divided by 9. Now I will multiply both sides by a square b square, a square b square, this side also a square b square. So I will be writing our equation 1 as a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 244 divided by 9 times a square b square. This equation is our equation 1. And after substitution, I will be writing our second equation as a plus b equal to 4. So let me write here a plus b equal to 4. This equation is equation number 2. And this is our first equation. Let's solve this new system of equations for a and b. So I can write here a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 244 divided by 9 times a square b square and second equation is a plus b equal to 4. Now I will write expansion of a plus b whole power 5. So for this we should be able to know the coefficients also. So expansion coefficient I will use Pascal triangle. For power 2, it is 1 to 1. For power 3, 1 3 3 1. For power 4, 1 4 6 4 1. For required power 5, 1 5 10 10 5 1. Let us expand. So I will write first and last altogether. This 5 coefficient altogether, 10 coefficient altogether. So I will be writing a power 5 plus b power 5. 1 is over. Now multiplier 5. So in bracket I need to write a power 4 b plus a b power 4. For multiplier 10 I will be writing a cube b square plus a square b cube. This is our expansion. Now I will write a plus b whole power 5 equal to a power 5 plus b power 5. Now a b is common. So I will take a b common out. In bracket it would be a q plus b q plus here a square b square is common. So 10 a square b square in bracket it is a plus b. Now I will substitute values. a plus b is 4. So here I will be writing 4. a power 5 plus b power 5. This is our equation number 1. And left hand side I will write 4 power 5. So let us apply 4 power 5 equal to 244 divided by 9 times a square b square plus a cube plus b cube value. We have to find out. Let me write as it is. A B 
टाइम्स ए क्यू प्लस बी क्यू प्लस टेन टाइम्स फोर फोर्टी ए स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर नाउ लेट अस कैलकुलेट दिस ए क्यू प्लस बी क्यू वैल्यू फ्रॉम इक्वेशन ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू फोर सो आई विल राइट ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू फोर कंसिडर क्यूबिंग बोथ साइड पावर थ्री पावर थ्री नाउ फॉर्मूला ए क्यू प्लस बी क्यू प्लस थ्री ए बी ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू फोर क्यूब इज सिक्सटी फोर नाउ ए प्लस बी इज फोर सो आई विल राइट ए क्यू प्लस बी क्यू प्लस थ्री ए बी टाइम्स फोर इक्वल टू सिक्सटी फोर or i can write a q plus b q value it will be equal to 4 common in bracket 16 minus 3 ab now i will apply this a q plus b q value here and let's see what equation will come out i will write 4 power 5 equal to 244 divided by 9 Times a square b square. Then we have five ab. Then a cube plus b cube value. I will be writing here. It was four common in bracket sixteen minus three ab. And last term was forty a square b square. Now I can see four is. they are common in both the sides so i will divide this equation by 4 so let's divide first so i will be writing 4 power 4 equal to 244 over 4 61 divided by 9 a square b square plus 5 ab i will write in bracket 16 minus 3 ab and this will be 40 over 4 10 a square b square so i can consider 4 power 4 as 256 61 over 9 a square b square plus 16 5 za 80 ab minus 15 a square b square plus 10 a square b square so from here we'll be having minus 5 a square b square so let me write 61 over 9 a square b square minus 5 a square b square plus 80 ab now i can write 16 a square b square divided by 9 plus 80 ab left hand side is 256 now i can write finally our equation will become 16 A square B square plus seven twenty AB minus two equal to zero. Now you can see equation is again divisible by sixteen. So let's divide. So I'll be writing A square B square plus forty five AB minus one hundred forty four equal to zero. now this is one quadratic equation in ab so i will use method of factorization so i can write 144 as 45 times no it will be 48 times 3 once i will take difference of these two then i will get my middle term 45 so i can write a square b square plus 48 ab Minus three ab minus one forty four equal to zero. So ab is common in bracket ab plus forty eight minus three is common in bracket ab plus forty eight. RHS is zero. So finally we have factors ab plus forty eight in one bracket, ab minus three in other bracket. so conclusion is ab plus 48 equal to 0 and second equation we can write ab minus 3 equal to 
So conclusion is AB is equal to negative 48 and from here AB equal to 3. Now A was positive, B was positive, this product must be positive. So we will reject minus 48 as it will generate complex solution. So this we will accept AB equal to 3. Let me write here AB equal to 3, A plus B equal to 4. Let's solve this new system and easy system also. Let us consider A and B are the roots of one quadratic equation. Then this is product of roots. This is sum of roots. We can think about quadratic in A itself. A square minus sum of roots. So sum of roots 4. A plus product of roots 3 equal to 0. Now I can straight away factor. I can write A minus 1 times A minus 3 equal to 0. So from here we can write a minus 1 will be 0, a minus 3 will be 0. Conclusion is a equal to 1, a equal to 3. Now a is 1, b is 3. Our equation is a b equal to 3. So I can write from here b will be equal to 3, b will be equal to 1. So if I will write our ordered pair, then I can write, let me write here, a comma b, it will be 1 comma 3 and 3 comma 1. Now a and b was our substitution. This was a, this was b, root x was a. So I will be writing root x comma root y equal to 1 comma 3 and 3 comma 1. Now to get the value of x y ordered pair I have to consider the squaring. So 1 is square 3 is square and 3 is square 1 is square. So our final answer becomes 1 comma 9 and 9 comma 1. This will be our real solutions. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.